this is my music channel, but I will also sometimes talk about music. And I noticed that in pop music, trans, techno, synth pop, synth wave, whatever style you're listening to, the vocals matter a lot. Of course, there's a lot of instrumental music and a lot of people listen to that. But the sort of songs that have any chance at all at going viral, usually almost all of them include some kind of vocals. It can be full on singing or just some sound bites, but whatever it is, you need a vocal. And so what happens is music producers around the world are in a competition with each other to find those new original vocals. What also happens nowadays is that, say, techno producers, they look at the old classical music from the 18th, 17th century to get vocals from, the, from those tracks. They weren't recorded in the 18th century, but modern performances have, like Carl Orff's uh, uh, show, for example, you take their vocals and you put a, put a techno beat under it. And so you see a lot of recycling going on. And sometimes the people who recycle have most success. So something's been done like a dozen times before in the 1980s, 90s, 2000s, and someone does it again in a new form, and all of a sudden it goes viral. So how do you approach this done? If you're a music producer and you want to score that hit, you need vocals, what do you do? Well, either you find humans who can actually sing, uh, men and women who have that unique original sounding voice, because that's what it's all about after all. And then you get them to write lyrics or you write your own lyrics and you get them to sing on your song. But if they truly have an original unique sounding voice, that means they're already famous by the time you find them. So that doesn't work for most starting uh, music uh, producers. You've got the AI voices nowadays. They're getting so good that uh, you can actually use them for pretty good singing uh, I've made a couple of songs where I used AI voices for singing and it sounded pretty pretty all right. There were lots of people who didn't know that this was an AI voice. <laughs> I had to explain to them, you've been listening to a robot. you know. And then there's another thing is where you can sample movies, for example, or you can sample the old, old recordings. You know, Sometimes there's something useful there, but it will take a, a lot of time to scour through these masses of, of recordings that humans have left behind to date. You know, So either way, either way, I think the point of this video was, you want to go viral with any song, you either need some really interesting new sound if you're doing instrumental, but in most cases you're going to also need some kind of a vocal or some kind of singing that actually sounds really great. And that's just the, the most difficult part of music production really is getting access to the vocals.